Very well. Based on my investigation so far, I believe this next pack of monsters should be the last. Once again, please leave them to me. Hey! Hey! Uh, are you sure you're all right? You're scaring us! <clears throat> Fear not. Fighting is what I do best. There is no escape! Illusion shattered! Are you alright? I'm fine. I... Inazuma shines eternal! Illusion shattered! Hey, maybe you should leave this one to us. I... My apologies. Monsters. Look, that's the same light again. Where am I? Who are you? Uh, Almighty Shogun, you're here too. Are you injured, Your Excellency? Uh, I'm quite all right. Just feeling a little stiff. We, the Shogunate Samurai, will defend the Shogun until the very end. Come on, men! They're coming back for more! Let's get them! Don't! It's too dangerous. Danger is our duty, ma'am. If we were the kinds to shy away from danger, we never would have taken up arms to begin with. No need to worry, Almighty Shogun. 
When the situation looks bleak, we will draw on the power granted to us by the gods. Is that a vision? It certainly is. I know the gods are omnipotent, and their willingness to grant their power to humans means they have high expectations for us. If the almighty Shogun is in trouble, now of all times is the moment for us to honor that. So that's how samurai of that era understood visions, huh? Nobody knew where your excellency had gone, and we were starting to despair. But now we've found you. You're right here with us. Just the sight of you appearing before us once more has reignited the hope in our hearts. This hope is the light that will guide us out from the darkness. Everyone, on me! We'll help too! Huh? Affirmative, but watch your backs. Protect the almighty Shogun! Right now, right here, right now. Stabilize! This is order! Erase up! Give up! Right here. I'm always watching. Illusion shattered. It's nothing. I will have order. Give up. Emerge. Right here. Emerge. There is no escape! It seems like their attacks are finally over. <laughs> I've never fought so fiercely before. Thank you all. Um, are you okay? Maybe you should keep resting. I'm fine. I feel much better already. You fought phenomenally. It was truly awe-inspiring. The monsters will definitely come back. And when they do, it'll be more than a few rift hounds this time. Quickly, escort Her Excellency back to Inazuma City, and regroup with the General's forces as soon as possible. When everyone sees the Almighty Shogun safely returning, their spirits will be lifted. Well? What are you guys gonna do? We will stay here and guard against the monster's advance. We cannot afford to let them get any further. We are brothers in arms. As long as we stick together, we can face any number of monsters that come our way. <sighs> Just leave it to us. Fighting is what we do best. But the Almighty Shogun is the only one of us with the power to change the present state of affairs. Only Her Excellency can turn back the tide of despair and lead us onward into the future. No matter what kind of threat faces Inazuma, we will always place our faith in the Almighty Shogun. Oh, thank you all very much. I promise you that I will create a bright future for Inazuma. I should not have left it this late to make this promise. But from this moment forth, know that I shall be true to my word. Don't worry, Your Excellency. We will never doubt your word as long as we live. With you leading us, we will claim back everything that Hinozuma has lost. Glory to the Shogun! Glory to the Shogun! They're gone. It was both. The people's sacrifice has always caused me immense pain. But in dwelling on the tragedy, I overlooked their splendor. The grief blinded me to how brightly they shone in their final moments. The result being that in the centuries since their sacrifice, I have dishonored their will. You could take the view that whatever I say to them is meaningless, because they are but disembodied memories held in the ley lines. But even so, 
They are due a resolution. I owe it to them and to all the people who have placed their faith in me to date. Well, Paimon thinks that even if it's a few hundred years later, you're doing right by them now, and that's what counts. Thank you for your comforting words. But this is my basic duty as Inazuma's Archon, and I have neglected it for far too long. I used to think just like that samurai, that I was first and foremost a warrior, and my only duty was to face whatever challenge came my way. But what Inazuma needs more than a warrior is someone like Makoto. Even though I am utterly unlike Makoto and can never become the person she was, I still need to do the things that she would have done. Yes, they are. They are strong and resilient and have much to be proud of. As the Raiden Shogun they revere, I should not be the one to hold them back. Well said. Sounds to Paimon like you figured things out. Change will come to Inazuma, and with it, new possibilities. This will take time, but eventually, the future will bring healing to the scars of the past. No matter how long it takes, I am committed to bringing this to fruition. This is my promise. Now that we've dealt with the Rift Hounds, this matter is halfway resolved. It does not appear that the threat will escalate for the time being. I will leave the Tenryo and Yashiro commissions to handle the follow-up work, such as investigating the origins of this incident and tending to the root system. Alrighty then, let's move on! They look calm on the outside, but Paimon bets her emotions must be all over the place right now, huh? She seems to have changed a lot since we last met her. Huh? What's wrong, eh? Come on, keep up! <sighs> What's going on? Are you feeling unwell again? Uh, my body... I can't move it. Uh, it looks like... The situation mm, is more serious than I thought. <sighs> no need. <sighs> she is calling me. Mm. The time has come. <clears throat> Can you help me walk? <sighs> I need to go to the cave. Below the Grand Narukami Shrine. Why? What's in there? <sighs> A battleground. <sighs> One where I shall sever ties with the past <sighs> and take the first steps into the future. We're finally here. The entrance should be nearby. Whoa! Where'd that Tori gate come from? Uh, it's getting worse again. But it's fine. I'm happy. I'm about to put an end to it all. This is a place I once sealed off with my own hands. 
the entrance to Raiden Makoto's realm of consciousness. Uh, it looks like she will no longer allow me to do with this body as I please. Huh? What are you talking about? And who is she? Makoto? <sighs> Follow me. We meet again, Traveler. This body is an assistant to the one within, but it is also the guardian of the rules. Should the one within wish to stray from the rules, this body shall stand in her way. Wait! Paimon knows that voice! Is that... the puppet? You have wandered the realm in my body, and you appear to have grasped the true essence of eternity. You believe your present self has greater certainty than your former self. Thus, you believe your present self is correct, don't you? But have you really been enlightened with new ideas? Or have you been degraded by irreversible erosion? I'm here to show you my answer. We are both warriors, and the dialogue we must now have shall be conducted by the Blade alone. The discomfort I was experiencing earlier was caused by the Shogun rejecting my continued use of her body. As she indicates, once I started entertaining the idea of change, I became hostile in her eyes. But inside a realm of consciousness, I exist independently of her. She cannot affect me in this way. Though she is a puppet, the Shogun has her own consciousness too. When necessary, she appears here to confront me. Uh, Paimon gets that everyone has their internal battles and stuff, but not like this! It's a bit extreme! Hey, showdown with the Shogun? <sighs> Never thought we'd see that day! The rules I set for the Shogun are... No. The Shogun herself is the manifestation of my past ideals the very foundation stone of eternity. It shall not be easily swayed. I would not try to change her if it wasn't necessary. Isn't there any other way? Can't you talk it through or something? But they both just want the best for Inazuma. My form is a symbol of supreme majesty in which has been vested power over all the realm. It is the cohesive embodiment of all that constitutes the Raiden Shogun. It inherits A's pain, the pain of inevitable loss that comes as she moves forward. So too does it inherit her determination to reach eternity. Every action undertaken is for the sake of resisting erosion. Determination, courage, love, hatred, all of these will be degraded and distorted by the incessant flow of time. Only rules shall remain constant for eternity. Those were my thoughts when I created you. Now, they are towering obstacles that I have no choice but to overcome. You wish to make yourself my enemy? I am your past, the everlasting law, the guardian of eternity. And I am she who promised a dream to her subjects. Ride an A!
In the end, even the proud and mighty Oni Maiden was cut down and disgraced. Though your blade has been cleansed of her blood and filth, never shall it shine as brightly as it once did. Torn to oblivion! Weak. Pathetic. Weak. Pathetic. Shine down! Erase all threats! Inferior. Strike dead! The relentless erosion of time will never stop. There shall never be another. Never. For the rest of time. Absurd. Torn to oblivion. Weak, pathetic. Ha! Be gone! Shine down! Vision is futile. Be gone! Inferior. The eye sweeps the land. You shall perish! Ha! Inferior! Ha! <laughs> Only emptiness awaits! Have you finally defeated her? It appears your martial prowess has not dulled. But how long can your will remain strong? How the heck? In this realm of consciousness, her existence is tenacious indeed. She was built to resist erosion. Her will is stronger than any other living beings, including you and me. Maybe. But I have to prove to her that my present will is no product of erosion. The future I shall forge will be a grand undertaking. One that will be resistant to erosion. If I don't do this, the Shogun's rules can never change. 
and Inazuma can never move forward. This is my duty. No matter how long this battle may last, months, years, centuries, and no matter how many times we must fight, I will defeat her. Five hundred years ago, humanity proved their strength in battle. Here in the present, they rely on their ambition to challenge wayward practices, tear them out like the diseased wood of an old sakura tree, so that new, healthy branches might spring to life in their place. It is about time that I learn to trust them. I understand that. But if the dreams of which Makoto spoke are true eternity, a short moment for which the Shogun does not exist is nothing to fear. I fight for the everlasting future of Inazuma. However long the battle may last, it is but a drop in the ocean of eternity. I vow to the subjects of Inazuma that I shall one day return. This is my oath. Please, be my witness. During my absence, I place everything in Miko's hands. B but this means that... Pass on my words. <coughs> Looks like we got kicked out. Shogun to keep on duking it out in there forever? She was making sense, and maybe this is the only way to change the Shogun's rules, but still! Right? Also, A can be pretty stubborn at times, and has a history of rushing into difficult situations. But what if she gets too obsessed with winning, and she forgets why she's there in the first place? It could happen, and then she might never leave again! Yeah, we should help her out, like we did last time! The quicker she gets through this, the better! Is there any way we can cut down how long she needs to spend in there? Or, you know, help her win the fight? Well, whatever, we can't let anything bad happen to A while she's in there! Oh, but we also can't get in there anymore! Okay, well, first things first, we gotta find a way back in! Oh, come on, Brain Juice, don't feel time on now! Um, okay, maybe if we both ran into it at the same time really, really hard. Oh, you're right. Paimon nearly forgot about her. Who knows if she really understands. 